Hi everyone, I am Dr. Prudhvi Raj, Consultant Endocrinologist at Arit Hospital, Gachibowli, Hyderabad. Now I am going to discuss about few measures to have a healthy living if you are suffering with type 1 or type 2 diabetes. As you know, the basic pillars of type 1 or type 2 diabetes management is maintain your blood sugars in a normal range. And to maintain these normal blood sugars, you need to concentrate on your diet, physical activity, sleep, stress, and the medications or insulin. These five form the pillar of your diabetes management. Besides this blood sugar control, you need to maintain your BP in a normal healthy range that is below 130-80. You need to maintain your bad cholesterol like LDL cholesterol and triglycerides at a very normal range. Based on your other comorbidities, your range may be defined. And what are all the measures you need to take or predict the development of micro and macrovascular complications of diabetes? As you are aware, diabetes can cause multiple complications and it can affect every organ in your body. So periodically you need to get screened at least yearly once with the following investigations. One thing is very much your eyes are very much important here as you are suffering with diabetes, you are prone to develop retinopathy. So you need to get evaluated your fundus examination at least once yearly and your kidneys are very much under at risk if you are suffering with diabetes so you need to check your blood creatinine at least once yearly and your urine albumin creatinine ratio also you need to be periodically checked and as you are tend to develop fatty liver disease you have to check your liver function test once yearly as you are tend to develop heart disease and brain strokes at a young age you need to be screened with ecg and bad cholesterol at least once in a year and based on your neuropathic symptoms, we may order some special uh, nerve conduction studies for you also. And based on your symptoms, we may screen for the peripheral vascular diseases also. So have a word with your endocrinologist for this periodical assessment for the complications. And to have a healthy living, WHO, World Health Organization, has recommended certain vaccinations for the type 2 diabetes patients. If you are not vaccinated with hepatitis B in the childhood or in the last five years, you need to get yourself vaccinated with the hepatitis B vaccine as type 2 diabetes patients are at risk of developing uh, severe forms of influenza. They need to take their influenza vaccination every yearly at least and they need to have a vaccination of pneumococcal vaccination uh, at the age of 50 years and at the age of 65 years.